All right, guys, so we're done with Airbnb. Can't deal with it. All right, guys, so yeah this is it can't manage it just kidding um all right guys so we're in this unit or the other airbnb we we'll have but we end up making this decision we have a long term with it um short term rental was good while it lasts right uh -huh. Short term rental was good while it lasted, but we just in a disposition now where we are gonna make it go long term. Basically, as I said, we have to go long term with this. Um, uh, Shelly can share some other reasons. Well, the main reason is the level of work that it mm -hmm. comes with. It's not just cleaning. It's communication, it's overseeing, checking processes, mm. it's physically being at the property sometime, which is quite a distance from where we live. About an hour. About an hour drive, depending on traffic conditions. So, all that take up a lot of time. And we have small kids, so. And work. And, and work. <laughs> and the cabins. Yeah. So, we decided that this one would better serve. For long term than on Airbnb. Yeah. So, hey yeah guys, so basically, we are, because we had it, um, we were trying to rent it furnished, but we weren't getting other offers um, as it related to renting it furnished. Yeah. So, we found a tenant and they want to rent it unfurnished. So we are here today. Um just packing up the stuff. We move them out. Um well we're not gonna move everything no we just have pack up like the accessories and the little decorations and all of that stuff today. Tomorrow now we are move the heavier stuff when we get the truck and so on. So yeah, this is it. As we say, we carry up on the journey with we when we set it up. So we are carry up on the journey with we when we we'll pull it down. <laughs> <laughs> and I show you the reality of 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 yeah. this Airbnb yeah, just, thing. Of business in general. Yeah. You have to evaluate as you go along and yeah. you realize that something is not necessarily working out for you. And it's not even just financially, but health wise, in terms of the demand that it takes. Mm -hmm. If you realize that it is not serving you in that um, area, and if you realize that you have to be sacrificing other priorities for mm -hmm. it, then you have to just make a decision and make the adjustments. So mm -hmm. that's really how it goes because it's. On one side, I'm feeling a little sad because it's just a year ago that we put a lot of effort in setting up this space. Mm -hmm. And then one year later, we realized, say, no, this is too much for us. Yeah. But it's a decision that we have to take. So mm -hmm. we're taking it gracefully. Yeah. And it's not say it really is a bad thing because it works um, and it can work. But for us, for us specifically, yeah, because of our demands, basically, because what we have, you know, mm -hmm. all our we have our life demands, mm -hmm. you know, kids, work, all of one that. One year old, <laughs> yeah, it's kind of hard for, for manage the this place. one mm -hmm. and the cabins and do everything else we we'll have to do. And like we say, we'll have other projects that we're yes, as we at the same time, yeah. so. This is not the only thing we have doing, you know. Yeah. Some of it, I don't know if by this video you'll start seeing some of it, but a very exciting <laughs> new project. Yeah, man. So as I said, we have other things I work yeah. on, which you guys will see in the near future, if you don't see it. Mm -hmm. 
Um, so it's a whole heap of things. Um, so really and truly, that's why yeah, that's we really have to pull this one from out a short, short term mm -hmm. and put it in a long term. Right as we there. always said, the short term not really passive. Yeah. So it we work. have to yeah. that heavy work. So we're basically getting it passive now, mm -hmm. or at least close to passive. Close to passive. So we can use that time. Yeah to focus on the other projects that we have as well as the other demands in other areas of our lives. Yeah. So yeah, so we are carrying on a journey with we. Um, as we take down. As we pull down everything. Um we'll give a, a final tour of its setup. <laughs> All right. Yeah so this is the living room as you know mm -hmm. living room yeah we had like a workstation you know and the kitchen yeah Well, I really set up nice, you know, I'm not telling no lie. Nice like a unit. Where they put wash and the dryer on it, so. Mm -hmm. Go upstairs real quick. Mm -hmm. I'll come upstairs, I can see it in here, so. And then. I have one bedroom. All of them nice furniture, yeah. Fully AC, everything. I have a closet. Iron board, iron, everything. Care of my next bedroom. I must check the bathroom first. Yeah. Mm hmm. Shower. Everything is here, man. In this a storage. This is the other bedroom. Ceiling fan. Two beds. AC, chest. We move the TV with the panda already. And then the next closet here. Mm -hmm. So, yeah man, basically this is it guys. Mm -hmm. You might feel like a sad occasion, but we still own the property and I sell we sell it. <laughs> so And I sell we sell it so just that somebody will go and take care of it right now until they're ready again. Alright. So yeah. <coughs> so I'm just gonna show you <coughs> as we move out the furniture and get the property here upon the long term market. Alright? So, we finished yesterday's video. It's a premature, but um, what we get through yesterday, I'm going to show you what we do yesterday. Um, as I said, we did a clean out all of the accessories yesterday. Today, now we are um, take out the big stuff. So, 
I have to go pull down the bed, pull down the beds, and then wrap them up so the truck can come and pick them up. Yeah, so um, let me show you what we got you yesterday. Uh, so basically, take up some of the accessories, them so in the kitchen. See? Take up like the microwave and so stuff, empty that. This there. Um, in the living room. We take down all of these flowers, these fake plants. So, we are carry those. But these are got in a light day. We are carry those separately. We are chop get them. Eh? Center table, carry that separately. This carry separately. That is not carry separately. Um, we go upstairs. Pack up some of the sheet them and stuff like that. Move those plants. And this is storage. Empty the shelf them in the bathroom and then in the bedroom. So we took out the sheet them plants and so on. So basically today we are moving the big stuff, chest, beds, set here. Door, fridge, washing machine, dryer, all of that. So, um, yeah. So, eh? I pull on these beds now. I move them out. <laughs> Basically, we finish pack up these beds, rugs, mm -hmm. alright, I'm going to put these in a day, in a day, these will go back in the washing machine for travel with it, alright, right, so these plugs come in the back of the washing machine so I have to go put them back in the washing machine for travel with it protect the drum in the machine alright so I try to to put them back these bolts but they never had a line up so I do a quick google check to say if they not line up I have to take off the top of the washing machine so that's what we do over this. We have to take off the top okay. and push this down to make sure it's in line up. So and that me there, I don't know. I try to get them to, to catch back in place. Right, yes, sir. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So these bowls protect the machine when they have to transport it um, from one location to the next. So, I just threw it out of my hand. Yeah, I just put it in my hand. Yeah, I can't remember. Um, doing this. Yeah, man. So, that's it. I'm going to fix up this hand. Alright. Empty. Yes, dry out. Empty out. You can do it? Oh, I'm not going to take them down now. 
Let me do it. Let me ready. So, eat that in the truck come and gone, move out, wait for move out, we I go here now, because we have to move, well pack all of these stuff, I forgot me about the truck for pack up all of these stuff, so the truck actually just gone, um, so let me show you the place there now. So, as you can see, it's bedroom, bed's gone, and all of that. Um, next bedroom, bed gone, all of that gone. We have these are the linen the sheet, and so we have, so we have to move those out at a later date. But these are smaller things, so we can carry them. I'm sure you are going downstairs. Mm -hmm. I carry that table there in my van for myself. Gas, um, fridge gone, stove gone, washing machine and dryer gone. So, those I've got, um, where does screw I come from? Oh, uh, screw, screw up that. Right? Washing machine and dryer gone. Right? Um, I have one little issue. So, the machine that was there was a 220 machine, and I doubt that the tenant would have a 220 machine. So, if we make some change to that, we make it a 110 washing machine. Um, yes. Right, so, this table, I'm going to bring this next week. i bring this to the fan next week. And then we take off the TV after the wall. We have a lamp that we carry. Next week we we'll come for that. Or in the week. But this is a living room. Yeah, see? Living room empty out. Yep. So. Alright. Yeah, guys. So that's it for this video. You know, we are going to bring up on the journey with me. Um, with everything we we'll have. So. This is just one next day in our life, a next step in the journey and a circle. So this I will go for the long term market and then a lot of furniture here. Basically I switch out the furniture them in a few hours so and I like when I have no use for it. I have use it every every single piece I get switch out. So we stove, we have a stove for like since twenty sixteen. How much year is that? Eight years? Mm, and it won't change now, so we get a new store for Christmas. <laughs> yeah, guys, so I eat that. So, you know, if you do, like, comment, share, subscribe. And until next time, keep the dream alive. We're out.